Hello everyone, Shadow Godzilla X here, and I'm here to talk about uh, <clears throat> some underrated movies. Uh, but and what I mean by underrated that I think they're really good, but I hear a lot of hate about them. So I'm gonna go get them because I forgot to sum up. <laughs> Alright, so I got a stack of movies. Four movies I'm going to talk about. I find a rated three. And four. I don't know why I said that. And all but one are sequels. First one Terminator 3 Rise of Machines. Um. I really enjoy this movie. I don't know why. I didn't think I would enjoy it that much, but surprisingly enough, it was really good. And it's definitely not as good as Judgment Day or the first one, but it's definitely better than, uh, well, it's kind of on the same level or a bit of the level of salvation. Uh, I love the, you know, the turn in this. The chick one. I like how um, it's basically combining the first turn air from the first movie with the turn air from the second movie, who's like liquid emitter windy stuff. I think that's really cool. Um, so yeah. Actually, yeah, I should say why I really do like it. Action scenes, love them, love them, mo well, most of them. Uh, the characters are likable. You really, you really want them to uh, stop Judgment Day. And Ar and Arnie, old old Arnie. Um, sorry, I'm scratching my nose. And good old Arnie pulls out the turn air. Still epic, as always. Though, eh, this time around, it feels a little more comedic. This, this is probably, compared to the others, the funniest one. Compared to the others. Well, may not the funniest, but. Funniest, but you know what I mean. I say check it out. It's, it's actually pretty good. Next one is Van Helsing. I find this one very un underrated. I can see. I know I said this before in my update, but I know why people hate it. It's very cluttered. There's so many, so many uh, good story arcs they can go with. <clears throat> but uh, they never continue them, and I think that's just one of its biggest flaws. But the story, I like the story. It's simple yet complex. It's very simple. You gotta try get a uh, try and take over the world. But there's this big mystery and stuff, and has werewolves. And Frankenstein monster. The thing is, it's CGI fest, a total CGI fest, but it's not always bad. Part in a way. Um, the CGI fest is done well, like from well, good or great. Then doesn't matter. 
Now it's done bad, but people care. Uh, CGI, amazing. Love it. Keep track, that course is always great. Uh, yeah, I say go check this out. So, next I'm going to be, ta be talking about... Also, speaking of Hugh Jackman, extra in the last stand. Um, I didn't like this as much as I did X2, but I still there's some really, but there's still some really good things about it. I like the whole cure story arc, uh, the war and stuff. It's hard to explain, but I say still, I still say go check it out. It's, it's, it's decent. That's good. Um, last one I'm going to talk about is X Men Origins Wolverine, my favorite. Well, maybe my second favorite. Close. It's tied with the Wolverine. So, yeah. Um. God, I love this movie so much. The action is. Oh, awesome. But I think that sucks. Deadpool and Gambit. Both awesome. Both. Blech. I can't talk. Deadpool and Gambit, both awesome mutants. And yet they're barely in there. That's my... That's really, pretty much my only major issue. Other than that, I love this movie. Go check it out. I do have two other movies I want to talk about, but I don't feel like talking about it. So yeah. It's pretty late. Uh, <laughs>